For today, at Joe McBride, I'm going to make us a lovely side dish, which we all love, garlic bread. Come and join me and let me show you step by step how it's been done. Take your big French loaf and cut it into halves. The reason why I'm doing this is the loaf is too big for my bride. Take your mortar and pestle and add the 75 grams of butter, 2 teaspoons of sweet basil and the 4 crushed cloves of garlic to it. Crush the ingredients till smooth and soft. The mortar and pestle just make the mixing process so much easier. Cut the bread in skew slices, 3 quarters deep from the bottom, about 10 centimeters apart. Take your kitchen knife and add the butter mixture to the cuts in the bread. Add enough butter mixture to the cuts because the butter mixture is going to melt in the bread. Do this process on both loaves of bread. Take your cheese spread with a clean kitchen knife and add the cheese spread with the butter mixture on the cut slices on the loaf of bread just like you did with the butter. Add the cheese spread to taste. With me, the more the merrier. Take your tin foil and cut your tin foil in the length of each loaf of bread. That means you're going to need two pieces of tin foil. Add the loaf of bread onto the tin foil and wrap the loaf up with the foil. Remember the shiny part on the side of the loaf. Do this process on both loaves of bread. Get your braai up to 250 degrees Celsius of heat and add the two loaves of bread to your braai. Turn the loaves of bread around every 7 minutes. When you turn your bread around for the second time, open the foil and add your 100 grams of shredded cheddar cheese onto the loaves of bread to melt. Close your braai lid to melt the cheese. The melting of the cheese took me 2 minutes. When the cheese is melted, remove the loaves of bread from your braai and serve. Another side dish, done and dusted. Thank you for watching. See you next time.